weeks, days before a Branford Animal Shelter's biggest fundraiser of the year, hundreds of dollars in donations have been stolen. Neighbors in Branford and surrounding towns coming together to make sure the event is still a success. News 8's Amy Hudak has more on the investigation and how the community is rallying. Amy. Darren, Wolfstock is the biggest fundraising event of the year for Dan Cosgrove Animal Shelter. Volunteers have been collecting donations since March, but yesterday they learned everything they've been working for was all taken. The outpouring has been really pretty awesome. Laura Burban and volunteers for Wolfstock get together and add up donations pouring in from around town in the state. It's amazing. Our community is absolutely amazing, and the communities surrounding us are amazing, too. Days before Dan Cosgrove's biggest fundraiser of the year, $1,500 in donations collected over six months were stolen from a volunteer. She put all the stuff together for us in a box, and one of our staff members was going to go over and pick up the box outside of her, of her front door. The box? Taken right off of her front step on Hobson Avenue. The hearts of volunteers shattered. That's kind of what makes us so sad is this is um, for homeless animals. The animals really need us because they don't have a voice. We're their voice. As Branford police investigate, people and businesses are stepping up. Branford's a big animal loving community. A local car dealership writing a check for $1,500 and a neighbor donating 1000 out of his own pocket. So we want to, you know, save them and find them new loving homes. Animals give so much to us. So if you have an animal in your life that gives you joy, if you can do a little something um, to give back to the animals that need us. Volunteers pleading with the person who stole the box to find it in their heart to return it. If we don't get the funding, then we can't help the animals that we do. Police say they do not have any leads yet, but they did begin investigating today. About 5,000 people are expected to attend Wolfstock on Saturday. Live in Branford, Amy Hudak, News 8.